all boats. Peter back again, and Matt. He tried to get, he tried to get out of this one, but the two of us get up to a bit of mischief, and the other boys make out like they don't know what we're doing, but they're watching very intently. So what we're going to try and do is see if the little tiny tot will drag the D11 off the mark in neutral with the park brake disengaged. I suspect it won't, but and then we'll probably try to see if we can get it rolling. And if we get it rolling, put the D11 into neutral and see if it'll keep it rolling. Anyway, here's Matt. He's trying to make out. He's trying to make out like it's all my idea and none of his. Oh, I didn't have it. This wasn't my idea. I just rock up today and you say I'm thinking about going down to see if the D4 will pull the D11 in neutral. <laughs> he makes it sound like we're the crazy ones. Let's we'll see what happens. Is that hopefully dad can sleep at night now <laughs> it's got a big heart <laughs> but um yeah it didn't really feel close to up there no i was hoping you would have faked it a bit longer and made out like i was pulling uh, you, need... didn't, you didn't give me nothing to work with no no you, we've got to test it out <laughs> no favors well the strap didn't break anyway no well I don't think that D4 is going to pull 50 Look, ton. Hey, you feel turning up after it's all over. I wonder if he saw it. What if you know? ask him? I bet you did. We'll see if he, he, he can guess. What do you think happened, Phil? Uh, well, I saw it from the excavator. <laughs> and see the skid marks here on the D4. So that's a telltale. She's, she's all heart, but not much else, isn't it, mate? Well, it's pulling uphill too, and it's still greasy, it's um, soft dirt, so I don't know whether you could go up there and You're, and you're encouraging this behaviour, Phil. Well, he yeah. he well, just tried to say it was all my idea. Oh, <laughs> right. Yeah, well, I, I mentioned it to Dad and then he couldn't, couldn't sleep, so... You, you have, have to, to do it. it. Well, let's, let's try again. Unless you just keep going backwards here, actually. Yeah, just go backwards. Well, folks. Tiny top failed the first test, but we're going to have another crack. Matt's going to get in tiny three, fills in tiny top. We're going to get it off the soft, the D11 off the soft ground, because we reckon the little one had all heart, but not much else. So we're going to get it slightly downhill on the firmer ground, and if it doesn't do it then, well, that's it. Anyway, it is a bit silly what we're doing, but we're having a bit of fun.
tiny tot. Oh, look, that's not fair. That was a bit cruel. It was look, it was looking good until Matt gave a little bit of a push to the tiny tree. Well, anyway, folks, that was. You got to take your hat off for having a crack. What do you reckon, mate? He's got a big heart, the day four. He has got a big heart. Uh, it just helps a bit pulling down hill and on that harder ground. On the, yeah, it, it was a bit cruel when Matt put the dropped the clutch, put her in the gear, and that was a I bit. Didn't even feel a thing. Yeah, that was a bit cruel, mate. <laughs> like we had a good story to tell there until you put her in gear and took off, hey? I didn't even notice it. <laughs> Here it is, here we are, all feeling sorry for Tiny Tot. Well, we've got Tiny Tot now, the D11s are safe when they get bogged. <laughs> well, I think that was fairly interesting. Um, on the harder ground, little slight downhill slope, it seemed to pull it not too bad. So that actually, that D4 is roughly about 11 tonne. Um, these D11s are about 100 or a little bit over. So it's pretty well one tenth the size. Um, so yeah, but I think it was it was pretty well at its limit. Um, it was starting to lose traction pretty pretty quick there. But the other thing is, yeah, once I did hit this into gear just at idle, um, yeah, just walked away with it. So uh, which is understandable. It's not meant for that, but all the same, it was fairly interesting. Anyway, just another thing we find to uh, waste a bit of time, have a bit of fun with the gear. But uh, we might leave it there. We'll catch you in the next one.